So the first basic process that people have to understand is the pinch effect. So the pinch effect, although not by that name, was discovered by Ampere 200 years ago. So when you have two currents moving in the same direction, they attract. If they're moving in opposite directions, they repel through their magnetic fields. So what this means is that in a plasma, in space, you have a natural tendency of currents to organize themselves. First of all, it's unstable because obviously you have the acceleration of structure formation uh, through these currents and the currents organize themselves into filaments. Now, in this process, especially in space, you have an additional effect, which is anisotropic conductivity, a magnetized plasma. So what happens is electrons or ions moving in a magnetic field circle around the magnetic field lines. They can only cross the magnetic field lines when they're hit by another particle, so they have a collision. Well, in space, plasmas outside of stars are so undense that the collision rate is insignificant compared with the gyro rate. So that means that electric currents are constrained to go along the magnetic field lines which the currents create. So what Alphane and Feldheimer discovered uh, 60 years ago, more, is that that means that a basic organizing structure in the universe is a force-free plasma vortex filaments in which the currents along the outside are almost circular, and they produce uh, fields along the inside, which are straight lines, and the currents that are running along those fields on the inside produce the fields on the outside that those currents run around. And in between, uh, the currents run in uh, helixes. So this is something that's been seen millions of times in the laboratory and in the cosmos. So if you take these basic processes and we say, how far back in time can we understand the history of the cosmos? Because we're not saying, oh, we can sort of intuit a beginning, because there is no beginning. But we look back as far as we can. If we look back as far as we can, we can envision a point in the evolution of the universe where there was a uh, hydrogen plasma. So nothing was existing except protons and electrons. And of course, uh, electric and magnetic fields. Tired of inflation, wars, and inequality caused by the energy crisis? LPP Fusion is developing a solution that could allow everyone to have cheap, clean, off-grid, and sustainable fusion energy. Invest now as we seek to bring this potentially life-changing technology to market. For more information, visit lppfusion.com.